So here we go. F, all right? So what is this? F, all right? Uh, is iodine, three of them, right? So what do we do? We say iodine has seven valence electron, less times three. Don't forget that there's a negative charge there. So electron plus one. So total number you have is 22, which is an even number. And therefore, I'm sure there's no radical. It's not a radical. All right, that's what we discussed. A single uh, electron that is not bonded kind of species. Okay, so without further ado, let's draw it out. All right, iodine, iodine, iodine. Okay, and we know we have this and we have this. Okay, so it all started with a negative charge, which is here. And therefore, I know I'm going to put a electrons here. And what do we need to do? All right, iodine, we know it has seven valence electron. So uh, I will want to start at this side to fill it up first, right? So I'm going to use a cross to remind myself one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay, so I utilize the iodine on my right hand side, the seven valence electron. So next, what do I have to do? Now, I look at it, I got two iodine left. And I know both of them, there's seven. One of the rules that we say at the end, you check, is that the iodine at the corner must always have eight. That is for sure. Currently, these have eight. I need to make this eight. So I write it down first in my mind. It must have eight. I don't care what you do. You can tell me whatever strategy you have. I'm not interested. I'm interested to have eight there. Because if it's not eight, I'll mark it wrong. Okay? So what do you do? I would think I'm going to do that. I'm going to have this fill up first. I'm not going to fill it in the middle. Why? Because the middle is a period three and below element. It can expand anywhere and any way it wants. So I'm going to do this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Make sense? So there's eight in the wall. So now I go to the iodine in the middle. You will then use the dots. Users one, left with how many? Six more. Nicely done. Three sets of lone pairs, which I will orange it to show you. If you look at iodine, how many electrons does it have? I have a lot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yes, ten. But it's okay because it is a period, don't know, four or five or six, right? It's a period three and beyond below element, which can expand its octet. Okay, make sense? That's it. Just make sure the one at the corner is it, and you're good to go. And there's no free radical, as we have confirmed right at the start using electrons. If you would like to catch my latest videos, click on subscribe button right now. And click on the bell if you want to receive instant notifications once I've uploaded my latest video. If you'd like to join my live chemistry classes and revision workshops, go on to winnerseducation.com and find out how you can score distinction for chemistry on a consistent basis, either in our center or online via Zoom. If you want to check out my online school, go on to passwithdistinction.teachable.com. You'll be able to learn chemistry concepts at your own pace and anywhere in the world, topic by topic. This is Sean Chua from Winners Education to your distinction in chemistry.